It is the final of the Discam Brain of Cape Talk. My name is Africa Madani. Lovely to be here. In the studio today, we have winners of weeks one through four. An exciting hour, the previous hour, that determined Riaz Janudin from Plumstead as the final semi finalist who will be going head to head with Clive, James, and Daniel for the honor of being crowned the Discam Brain of Cape Talk for 2022. And of course, the ultimate prize of 20. 20,000 rands. If you are listening to us and you'd like to see what we look like, you are most welcome to go to our website, capetalk.co.za. Better yet, go to Facebook, follow us if you don't, and you'll be able to see our wonderful, handsome faces that come with these mellifluous voices. I'm not alone in One studio. One out of two is not bad. <laughs> I'll leave it to you to decide which <laughs> one of those two is the one. Bruce Whitfield, you're just hearing him, host of The Money Show. He's our quiz master today. Hello, Bruce. Africa, good afternoon to you. Just a couple of rules, just that Clive and everybody else knows. Clive, hello. Um, spelling question, you must at least make a significant effort to spell the word. If you pass it, I spell it slowly back at you um, and then we'll be fine, friends. And if we get the same scores at the end, as we've had three rounds of sudden death, my favourite treat, it's my treat for doing this, is sudden death because I get a great thrill out of sudden death. Um, and then we play the game. If you did miss those rounds, by the way, you'll find them on Facebook and our YouTube channel channel do watch it really really exciting and amazing all right it's time now to find out who the disc game brain of cape talk for 2022 will be clive is from Cork bay he was the winner of week one he's a chemical engineer by profession has been listening to cape talk for the past 20 years in his spare time he enjoys reading and playing the guitar good morning to you clive i mean good afternoon to you clive good afternoon Africa. what are you reading at the moment um, I'm thinking about other stuff currently. Okay. <laughs> Not thinking about the books In that the he's zone. reading. Hakan Nasser. Okay. Yeah. Um, are you ready to take a stab at winning the title in 20,000 Rand. Let's get on with it. Let's get on with it. Bruce, <laughs> oh, no. he's all yours. He's quite stressed, so let's talk rubbish for 10 minutes. Um, Asanda Galiba, Daniel Motta, and Barry Levenrad provided some questions for this final. So thank you, Asanda, Daniel, and Barry for making a contribution. Clive, if I may begin. Yes, please. Mario, your 90 seconds, please. Three, two, one. Spell the word electricity. E-L-E-C-T-R-I-C-T-Y. Correct. Complete the saying, half a watt is better than no bread. Half a loaf. Correct. True or false, Pretoria is further west than Bloemfontein. False. Correct. Which provincial coat of arms shows a bunch of grapes? Grayson Cape. Correct. Complete the name of the famous dish, what, Benedict? Eggs. Correct. Which of the five vowels is not used in the word disposable? You. Correct. In cars, the abbreviation SUV stands for what utility Sports. vehicle? Correct. Mpoor Palazzi is the mayor of which metropolitan municipality? Buffalo City or Johannesburg? Buffalo. Johannesburg. Give the third letter of the word nauseous. You. Correct. Which of the which ocean is the Red Sea a part of? Uh, Indian. Correct. Which part of your body are the muscles that are nicknamed quads? Or the legs. Correct. True or false? Semilon is a red wine cultivar. False. Correct. Which is the name of the currency used in Algeria? Euro or dinar? Dinar. Correct. Which sport does the Rafael Wed Jane play for South Africa? Netball. Soccer. Which local food is a spicy vegetable that relish? Chakalaka or bubur? Chakalaka. Bubur. Correct. Uh, which local food, which is a spicy vegetable? Uh, true or false? John Steenhuisen is older than Julius Malema. True. Correct. Which African country is Renamo the main opposition? Mozambique. Mozambique. Or? Correct. Very good. 17 questions asked and answered. Uh, I take offence to some of the questions, I'm afraid. Um, <laughs> which ones? Which is the third letter in the word nauseous? You. Hurtful, <laughs> hurtful, hurtful. I don't mean to make you nauseous, Clive. I'm sorry. Um, and then I, I think question number one was unfair. Spell the word electricity. I mean, it's not something that we know very well. Because of load chain. <laughs> exactly. Very clever. Very clever indeed. Yeah, and that of was course, a good round, Clive. Thank it you. was indeed. 17 is the number of questions asked and answered within the uh, allotted uh, 90 seconds. How did Clive do, Bruce? Very well. Um, two questions wrong. Mpopalatse is the new mayor of the city of Johannesburg. And, of course, uh, Rafil Wajain plays soccer for South Africa. Um, and so, yeah, that is a firm 15. Firm 15 so is a very wonderful way to 
to start this final round of the Discam Brain of Cape Talk. The winner of this contest, of course, not only will win themselves 20,000 Rand and be crowned the winner, but also they, he or she, will uh, have the title of Brain of Cape Talk for 2022. James was a winner in week two. He's a medical doctor by profession. Started listening to Cape Talk when he moved back to Cape Town at the beginning of the pandemic in March 2022. In his spare time, he enjoys birding and spending time with his three children. James, where did you move from? Am I close in? Oh, which part of the Eastern Cape? Uh, the Wild Coast. Oh, beautiful. Uh, uh, would I have chosen Cape Town over the Wild Coast uh, to it was be schooling in the needs, so Ah, yeah. that, that. Bro- broadband. <laughs> <laughs> broadband as well. Uh, James, 15 is a score to beat. All the best. Thanks. Bruce Whitfield. James, if you're ready. I am. Mario, 90 seconds, please. Three, two, one. Well, spell the word environment. E N V I R O N M E N T. Correct. Complete the saying. He calls a spade a what? Spade. Correct. True or false? Bloemfontein is further north than Durban. True. Correct. Which provincial coat of arms shows a thorn tree? Northwest. Northern Cape. Complete the name of the famous dish. What? A la king. Chicken. Correct. Which of the five vowels is not in the U word grapefruit? U. Oh, uh, in cars, the abbreviation AWD stands for all wheel what? Drive. Correct. Tanya Campbell is mayor of which metropolitan municipality? Peter Maritzburg or Ekuruleni? Peter Maritzburg. Ekuruleni. Give the third letter in the word bloodshed. O. Oh. Correct. Of which ocean is the North Sea a part? Atlantic. Correct. In which part of your body are the muscles that are nicknamed abs? Stomach. Correct. True or false? Columbard is a red wine cultivar. True. It's false. In the name of the currency used in Lebanon, the pound or the franc? Franc. It is the pound. What sport does Marizan Cap play for South Cricket. Africa? Correct. In local food, which is a rice dish, walkie talkies or birani? Biryani. Correct. Uh, true or false, Corne Mulder is older than Alan Windy? True. Correct. In which African country is the UDC the main opposition, Zambia or Botswana? Botswana. Correct. Which country hosted the Summer Olympic Games three times? The United Kingdom or Brazil? United Kingdom. Correct. In business, the abbreviation P and L stands for profit and... Plus. Correct. From which modern language is the word cul-de-sac? French. It would be, but I'm afraid uh, that question <laughs> was in itself something of a cul-de-sac. <laughs> Uh, which means uh, 19 questions were asked and completed. Um, Columbard, I've never heard of that cultivar. It's, it, it's, 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 it's an annoying varietal. Sorry, winemakers. Mm. It's sweet and flowery. and ugh, I don't know why. They shouldn't really be allowed to plant it anymore <laughs> because we've moved on. Oh, have we? It's the 70s. The 70s in a bottle is Columbard. And Lebanon has a Lebanese pound. It apparently. does. Something I've and for the first time today. Uh, grapefruit doesn't have an O. Um, and Ekuruleni is where Tanya Campbell is the municipal, uh, is the is the mayor. And of course, the cul-de-sac is French, but we didn't quite get to it. Which means out of those 19 questions, he got how many right? He got 14. 14. Which is close. Close, but no, close, cigar. But no cigar. Well, thanks, guys. Thank you very much, Thank James. You, James. Uh, Daniel is the winner of work uh, week three. He's from Claremont. He's a legal consultant by profession. Been listening to Cape Talk now for the last 10 years. He enjoys trail running and spending time on the beach with his children. How many do you have, Daniel? Uh, I have two. Two. How old are they? <laughs> um, my daughter's eight and my no, my oldest daughter's eight and my youngest is two and a half. But, and we also had a son, but he passed away. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, you, but yeah. but the, the, the two and a half year old, I understand completely why you are uh, slightly foggy. Slightly well, foggy. I, be also, foggy now. I also understand it's just come from a ah, bachelor's party. There's the fog. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I was meant to be there last night. I'm going today. So if I arrive empty handed, I'm going to be in big trouble. No pressure then. <laughs> Your 90 seconds starting shortly. Bruce, it's all yours. Daniel, I'm looking forward to the next 90 seconds. If I may begin. Mario, 90 seconds, please. Three, two, one. Well. Spell the word association. A C A S S O C R A. Pass. I A T I O N. Complete the saying. He came back in the nick of time. Correct. True or false? Johannesburg is further north than Mbombela. False. 
Correct. Which provincial coat of arms shows two cheetahs? Frito. Correct. Complete the name of the famous dish. Caesar what? Salad. Correct. Which of the five vowels is not used in the word compatible? View. Correct. In cars, the abbreviation EPS stands for electric what steering? Um, power. Correct. Randall Williams is mayor of which metropolitan municipality? Tswane or Tswane. Nelson Mandela Bay? Tswane. Give the third letter of the word brainchild. A. Correct. In which ocean is the Sea of Japan apart? Pacific. Correct. In which part of your body are the muscles nicknamed pecs? Um, your pecs on your shoulder. In your chest. True or false, Merlot is a white wine cultivar. False. Correct. What is the name of the currency used in Liberia? Dollar or rupee? Dollar. Correct. In what sport did Bianca Beitendach represent South Nepal. Africa? Surfing. In which local food baked in a sheep's head? Smiley or Mashonza? Mashonza. It's a smiley. True or false, Helen Zilla is older than Musiwa Lakota? True. It is false. In which country, African country, is the popular democratic movement the main opposition? Namibia or Lesotho? Uh, Namibia. Correct. Which country has hosted the Summer Olympics twice, Greece or Norway? Greece. Correct. In business, the abbreviation NDA stands for what agreement? Legal consultant? Non-disclosure. <laughs> Thank you. I'll tell you what. You go to the bachelor party. Take an, we'll sign an NDA. Because <laughs> I'm afraid. You're not going empty-handed, though, because you did well during the week. He did well during the week. Oh, well, he won last week. Exactly. So, so uh, he would have picked up, what, 10,000 rand in addition to whatever he'd won during the week before. So you can uh, absolutely claim that, which unfortunately, Daniel, means that you did not get the 15 that is required for us to uh, be um, at least playing a sudden round or going through. But congratulations. You did get a big ball 10. Double digits. Awesome. Well done. Uh, that was Daniel, uh, the winner of week three. Uh, now it's down to Riaz Janudin, who is from Plumstead, um, works in the health industry, proud dad of two kids, aged 10 and 17. Uh, he took us excitingly to a sudden uh, death round uh, an hour ago, or less than an hour ago, when he became the winner, of course, of the final of the semifinals uh, and um, answered an incredible incredibly difficult question when it comes to chemical compounds or whatever they call it. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, Riaz, very well done to you. Uh, you have to beat the score of 15 in order for you to win yourself not only the 20,000 rand, but the ultimate title of Brain of Cape Talk. Disc game Brain of Cape Talk for 2022. Good luck to you. Good stuff. Thank you. Riaz, we've done this once already today. <clears throat> I know that you are ready. He has his deep breath. Mario, 90 seconds. Three, two, one. Well, spell the word magnificent. M A G N I F I C E N T. Correct. Complete the saying. While the cat's away, the what will play? Mice. Correct. True or false? Cape Town is further north than Bishu. False. Correct. Which provincial coat of arms shows two buffaloes? Um, Limpopo. Correct. Complete the name of the famous dish. Waldorf what? Salad. Correct. Which of the five vowels is not used in the word journalist? E. Correct. In cars, the acronym VIN stands for vehicle what number? Identification. Correct. Nkoli Sikaunda is the mayor of which metropolitan municipality? Mangaung or Etiquini? Etiquini. Correct. Give the third letter of the word blueberry. U. Correct. Of which ocean is the Arabian Sea a part? Indian. Correct. In which part of your body are the muscles that are nicknamed the delts? Shoulders. Correct. True or false? Pinotage is a red Re wine cultivated. True. Correct. What is the name of the currency used in Somalia? Shilling or peso? Shilling. Correct. In what school does Janine van Veek captain a South African team? Netball. Soccer. In local food, what is a submarine sandwich? Makatan or Gatsby? Gatsby. Correct. True or false? Bantu Holomisa is younger than Herman Mashaba. False. Correct. In which African country is UNITA the main opposition? Angola or Mauritius? Angola. Correct. Which country has hosted the Summer Olympic Games four times? The USA or Canada? USA. It would have been correct. You were very slow on the spelling, which inhibited your the volume of questions that you could be asked. And that may very well be 
a deciding factor here? Uh, Janine van Weck, of course, is the captain of uh, Banyana Banyana, right? Uh, yes. South African team. The, she did very well in uh, qualifying for the African Women's Cup of Nations, which is going to be played a little bit uh, later. Uh, <coughs> so that, hold on, I just need to do a calculation here. So we got through 17 and a half questions, so you have to discount the 18. So it's 17 questions that he got right. He got one answer wrong. Africa, this is your chance now. What is 17 <laughs> <laughs> Minus one. If Miss Mabo in grade one would be proud, the answer is 16. So if 16 is more than 15, who is our winner? It means we have to say congratulations once again to you, Riaz Janadin. You. you are Cape Talks 2022 Discam Brain of um, uh, the Cape year. Talk. Of the year, exactly. Uh, you've won yourself a whopping 20,000 rand thanks to Cape Talk and Discam, a winning mind in a healthy body, and of course, the title. How are you feeling? I'm very relieved. Very relieved. Not doing it once, but doing it twice today there is clearly an advantage to coming in at the end right you have a better sense of what the questions are like and what the pressure and clearly a good strategy in slowing yourself down in answering the questions and rather getting them right nearly backfired i would have settled for a sudden death there i wasn't sure but it glad it worked out it did incredibly well as you were doing and you were doing this painfully slow spelling i was like <laughs> hurry up please hurry up but well done well done indeed well thanks to everyone for making the 2022 discam brain of cape talk the success that it is to all the contestants to the quiz masters and we're saying in the pool because it was bruce and john for the last uh, three weeks the juniors who really just made us all fall in love with knowledge again and of course our wonderful sponsor discam if you want to watch this round or any of the Saturday rounds you may have missed again, go to capetalk.co.za or go to our Facebook page. Thanks to Cape Talk and Discam, a winning mind in a healthy body. And Riaz, once again, congratulations. Thank you, Africa. <laughs>